good day this is smartwatch specifications.com the premier site for smartwatch specs news and reviews we are back with a wafit watch s10 and on this video we are going to connect it to our smartphone so we'll pair it with its support app we are using android smartphone here so we'll download the support app for this wearable and we will connect it and see if what are the other settings and options for the watch s10 if you are interested to see on how to connect the wafit watch s10 on your smartphone watch this video and of course support our channel like share and subscribe all right so let's begin and pair our wafit watch s10 or set it up with our android smartphone we have the QR code here for the app in the settings it's also available here in the user manual we have here also the QR code it's a link to a website where you can download the support app so let's try to download the app just to show you the process let me scan the QR code we have here the QR code let's scan this so open the app look for the Huafit smartwatch we have what we have is the Huafit S10 and what we have is the android smartphone so tap on the android and we have here the application glory fit app tap on install then wait for the completion of download it will automatically install it in our smartphone 78.54 78.54 mb only let's wait it's almost 100 percent here and it's now installing and as you can see here the application is successfully installed in our smartphone so let's open the app open the application glory fit let's wait for the dashboard here agree to the user agreement and privacy policy and as you can see here we do have a login form so we can use the Google account here or we can ignore so we will not record our data so we'll just ignore it but if you want to record your activities you can sign up with your email or your Google account. In our case, we will ignore it. Okay, run in the background. If you want it to be stable, you can set it to run in the background. Because this is just a test, we'll go directly. Then, select our profile here. Next, we'll leave it as it is. Then, next, complete okay so we are now on the dashboard of the glory fit app it's now time to add our watch s10 smartwatch to the support app and connect it with our phone so select device okay confirm enable use of location go back select device again then allow then the Bluetooth is not yet the Bluetooth is not yet activated we will allow it it's now enabling then while using the app it's now looking for our smartwatch and as you can see here we do have our Huafit S10 it's ready available here on the search area Okay, so let's bind to connect 
tap on the smartwatch here it's now connecting connected successfully so we are now paired with our smartphone and of course with the glory fit application and now it is asking for the bluetooth pairing request we'll pair it let's have the basic setup here let's activate our sms reminder if you want to receive notification let's turn it on i got it allow so just allow the permission if you want to activate it app notification also, also allow it look for the glory fit then we will allow go back go back then activate some of the apps here okay, i want to receive notifications from these applications okay then go back universal settings time follow system time follow device language yes got it find bracelet okay it's working okay don't allow first we'll use it later on so we have the call reminder notification activate just allow again the permission allow and allow go back then let's go to the device again bluetooth call with watch enable bluetooth call okay then sync contacts open let's add the contacts here import let's see if we have it here in the smartwatch not yet again finish sync and as you can see here we do have the contacts so everything is set now for our Wafit watch s10 with the glory fit application if you have any questions regarding this setup if you are having a hard time drop a comment below so we can help you and of course like share and subscribe this is your Wafit Watch S10. Bye.